Show what you know, and you should have a name on your paper. Turn, turn, no, turn that paper over. That's the page you should be on. Grayson, you too. Turn that paper over, and that's the page you should be on. Aaron, turn that paper over, and that's the page you should be on. Those homework pages on the floor. I ask you to put them in the mailbox. Is yours? Okay. In your mailbox. What you are doing, boys and girls. On number one, you're comparing the lengths. What it means is you're putting them or in order from shortest to longest by writing one for the shortest, two for the next shortest, and three for the longest. So you're doing that in order right there. So right now, order those pencils in order. One, two, three, whatever order the shortest to longest is. Shortest should be number one. Longest should be number three. Okay, then the next part. Use non-standard units to measure length. Okay, so if you are going to use these little blocks right here, how many of those blocks with this measure is what they are asking. Okay? How many of those blocks would you have to use to measure the whole distance of that marker? Okay, about how many blocks? Now we don't really have those blocks with us. So we're going to just Make it up. I guess I could. I didn't just see if I could make the shape. I don't Oh. So more long or 
or more short. EST means most. most, which means it's the most long or the most short. Okay? All right, so fill in the organizer, describe the lengths of different objects. So they put length right there. What do you think you put over here? Longer. Okay, you could put longer. Oh, I think, oh, there one. Fill in the graph and that. Describe the length of this object. Oh, so we're supposed to do two different objects oh. using one of those words. Okay, so I'm going to use Isaac's pencil and my marker. Okay, what's the sentence that you could say about these? Jason? Okay, the pencil is longer than the marker. Did you write that? Yep. This one. The pencil is longer than the marker. Okay. <laughs> Using a different word, we're going to compare your folder to this eraser, your folder to this marker board eraser. How could you say this using a different word? Aaron? The eraser is shorter than the folder. Yes, the eraser is shorter than the folder. Now wait. What if I did this? Ooh. What would you say? The eraser is the shortest of them all. The eraser is the shortest. Okay? We're going to say the eraser is shorter than the. the uh, I wish that came on there. Yeah. Okay. The eraser is shorter. And the folder. Okay, using these words, you need to look at these pictures of those uh, colored pencils, and you are going to write, answer the question basically. So number one says, the blue pencil is the blank pencil. <coughs> the blue pencil is the... Longer pencil, the shorter pencil, the longest pencil, or the shortest pencil. You're going to use one of those words in each of them. So you need to make sure that if it's comparing all three of them, you're going to use longest or shortest. If it's comparing two of them, if it talks about two pencils, then you know that you're going to use longer or shorter. Okay, try your best and we'll go see how you do.